A'udhu Billahi Bismi Ilai Inna Wali Allahu Allahumma Salli Ala Sayyidina Muhammad Al-Fatihi Lima Ulika Wa Katimi Lima Sabaka Nasir Al-Haqi Bil-Haq Wal-Hadi Ilai Siratika Mustaqim Wa Ala Alihi Haqa Qadrihi Wa Magdar Al-Azim Assalamu Alaikum Wa Rahmatullah My name is Sheikh Sufi. I am here to introduce the teachings of Sheikh Ahmad Abamba. Our master, Sheikh Ahmad Abamba, is the founder of the holy city of Tuba. He is the most prolific writer in the history of Islam. Sheikh Ahmad Abamba has written over 1,000 books. Yes, 1,000 books with his own hand. More than 1,000. I think the correct number is like 1,365. But uh, if you don't believe me, you can go to his city in Tuba. The holy city of Tuba has a library that I have been to. And in the library, they have all the books written by Sheikh Ahmad Abamba. And it's a library full of books written by one Sheikh. And the Sheikh wrote extensively on the teachings of Fiqh, Akita, and Tawheed. And specifically, Fiqh being the Islamic law, Akita is the belief in Allah and the six articles of faith. And Tawheed is the science of the oneness of Allah. Fiqh, Akita, and Tawheed are Sheikh Ahmad Abamba's teachings for his disciples. Sheikh Ahmad Abamba says a murid disciple must study Fiqh, Islamic law, Akita, the belief in the six articles of faith, and uh, Tawheed, the science of the oneness of Allah. He said you must study Fiqh, Akita, and Tawheed before you study Sufism or Tasawwuf. Sheikh Ahmad Abamba said that without the boat of Shariat, you will not be able to cross the ocean of Hakikat. Sheikh Ahmad Abamba says, without the boat of Shariat, or the basic Islamic teaching, you will not be able to cross the ocean of Hakikat. So it's very important for all disciples of Sheikh Ahmad Abamba to master the basic Islamic fundamental teachings, as in, how do I make my Salat? In order to make the Salat, you need to have a wudu. How do I make wudu? How do I make istinja after using the bathroom? How do I make a gushu, a purpose, uh, a spiritual bath? These are the basics. The, the wudu, the gushu, the bath, the istinja after the bathroom, and also how to make the salat. It's very important that all disciples of Sheikh Ahmad Abamba make the five salat. Sheikh Ahmad Abamba was so strict on his salat that he made his salat on the ocean. When the French captives were taking him into exile and they told the sheikh, you could not pray on our boat, he was so strict on his salat, he stepped off the boat and made his salat on the ocean. So we are the people of Sharia, the Islamic laws, because without the Sharia, you will not have any balance. Sheikh Ahmed Abamba described the, uh, the way that he teaches as an egg. Sheikh Ahmed Obama said, Islam is like an egg. Sheikh Ahmed Obama said, the outer shell of the egg is the shariat. And he said, the inner yolk of the egg is the hakikat or the Sufi teachings. So the egg must have the outer shell to give the yolk balance. So your practice must be based in Quran and Sunnah. So that your skyscraper of Sufism can have a strong foundation to stand on. Sheikh Ahmed Obama says, if it's not in the Quran... And it's not from Prophet Muhammad, it's not from me. Let me make that clear. Our beloved Sheikh, Sheikh Ahmad Obama says, if it's not in the Holy Quran, and it's not from the Sunnah of Prophet Muhammad, he says, it's not from me. Sheikh Ahmad Obama also went so far as to say, if your thought pattern goes outside of the Holy Quran, you will go astray. If your thoughts go outside of the Holy Quran, you will be astray. So our way, no matter what you see a disciple of Sheikh Ahmad Obama doing, if his way is Quran and Sunnah because the authentic teaching of the people of Tasawwuf or Sufism is based on the way of Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. There are many different Tariqat. Tariqat means Sufi order or Sufi path. Matter of fact, let me stop. You have what's called the Shariat, the outer law. The Shariat starts when you take Shahada, Ashadu in La Ilaha Allah, Ashadu in Muhammad Rasulullah. Then you have what is called Tariqat or inner path. The Tariqat starts when you find a sheikh from a Sufi order and you take the bayat. The first two levels, it says in the whole Quran, Islam is revealed in stages. The first stage is Sharia, Islamic law, Shahada. The second stage is Tariqat, finding a sheikh and taking the bayat. After the Tariqat, you can travel into the, the ocean of Hakikat. 
Hakikat is the truth of, truth of reality based on the understanding of la ilaha illallah. Hakikat is the understanding that la ilaha illallah is the only reality. But inside the ocean of Hakikat, there is the pearl of Marifat. Marifat is the fourth stage in which you can become an Arif Bilah. Arif Bilah is a nor of Allah who knows his oneness with Allah and knows his oneness with the universe. So that is Shariat, Tariqat, Hakikat, and Marifat. Also, Sheikh Ahmed Obama said, My way is based on Iman, Islam, and Isan. You must learn Iman, studied in the six articles of faith. You must learn the Islam, the five pillars. And the Isan is the perfection of character, where the Prophet Muhammad says, Isan is to worship Allah if you see, as if you see Allah, and to know that if you do not see Allah, Allah sees you. Inshallah, we will be teaching a class on Fiqh, Akita, and Tasawuf and Tawheed, and we will be teaching a class on Iman, Islam, and Isan. If you are interested in this class, it's going to be on Sundays mornings, Sunday mornings at I think 11 o'clock. Inshallah, it will start uh, next Sunday. Inshallah, it will start the first Sunday in May. But this is Sheikh Ahmed Bamba's way. It's based on Fiqh, Islamic law, Akita, the understanding and, and of the six articles of faith, and Tawheed, the science of the oneness of Allah. Sheikh Ahmed Bamba said, the greatest knowledge a person can have in the grave is the knowledge of Allah's Tawheed of the Kalima La Ilaha Illallah. We recommend all disciples who have taken the bayat to recite the La Ilaha Illallah at least a thousand times a day in the first year of Tarbiyah. The first year of Tarbiyah is La Ilaha Illallah a thousand times a day and a stock for Allah 313 times a night along with the cane of wisdom and you can find the cane of wisdom at 786sufiwisdom.com. The cane of wisdom is the weird for the new disciples. It has Sapanadil Mukli wa Malakuti, Sapanadil Izati wa Jabaruti, Sapanadil Hayaladi la Yamutu Sabun Kudusum Rabu Malaikati Ru, one time. It has the Salatu Fati, Allahumma Salila Sayyidina Muhammad al Fatihi Lima Ulika wa Katami Lima Sabaka Nasal Haki Bil Haq, wa Hadi La Saratika Mustakim, wa Allah Alihi Aka Kadrihi wa Makdar Ladim, at least a hundred times. And then it has the prayer of Yunus, La Ilahi La Anta, Sapanaka Ini Kuntumina Thalimin, at least a hundred times. My name is Sheikh Sufi. Email me at sheikhsufi.com. C-H-E, stock for Allah. C-H-E-I-K-H-S-U-F-I at gmail.com if you're interested in taking the classes on the teachings of Fiqh, Akita, and Tawheed, Iman, Islam, and Isan. Barke Sheikh Ibrafal al-Fatiha. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen ar-Rahman ar-Rahim Maliki Yomidin. Iyaka na budu wa iyaka na sta'in i di na sirat al-mustakim. Sirat al-latina nam ta'alayhim gari al-maktubi alayhim wala dolin. Ameen. Barka sirin sayu. 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 Fall, Yadam, fall.